Central State Criterium Series is all wrapped up for the day, but things will again pick up tomorrow for day three of the races. 42.9's Megan Key covered the races in downtown Rogers today, and she talked with some younger riders about their racing goals and what it's like for them to compete. For more than eight hours, cyclists raced through downtown Rogers, competing for money and titles in the Natural State Criterium Series. Multiple races were set up throughout the day, ranging from 25 minutes to an hour of constant cycling. Some cyclists have trained for years and years, competing in dozens of races, while others are younger, with fewer years under their belts, but eager to ride. For cyclocross, I did, even though I wasn't supposed to race in it, they let me on the track, so I did a little bit of it. I did the whole race. And then this is Elliot Back. The young cyclist is only seven years old and has already been riding for a year and traveled from Oklahoma to ride in the kids' race. He says he gets excited to ride and loves the adrenaline rush. He hopes to grow up and be a professional cyclist one day. A few years older than him is 16-year-old Jacob Smith Peters. He's ridden mountain bikes for the last three years and just recently started road biking. He rides with the Breakaway Cycling Team and competed in two races today. Well, we did the Cat 5 today, so I came out here with a bunch of guys my age on my team. We, uh, we all race together, we practice together. Um, we, I mean, we have wonderful coaches out here. That they, um, they do help us with a lot of our training plans, um, a lot of nutrition. Just Jacob placed fourth in the Cat 5 and third in the mountain bike crit race. He tells us his love for the sport keeps him going. I just really love road biking. So um, whether I'm exhausted or fully on my game, I'm going to be out here no matter what. Day three of the Natural State Criterium Series starts back up tomorrow morning in downtown Springdale. In Rogers, Megan Key, 4029 News.